Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel and chat channel. I'm tired. My name is Samata, you may call me Jettas, and I am in today's video doing something slightly different. We're doing a full vlog throughout the week. Um, I'm currently filming this the Saturday before the week, um, where I'll take you on a journey where I do the Go Green challenge. So, this is the week before I'm doing the challenge. I got inspired by In The Now's IGTV's Leaving In Your Friendly video with Tori Vasquez, who is more, mostly known for being on React ShutterFB, where she did the challenge herself. She's a college student, so uh, she was just trying to live more eco-friendly and she inspired me to wanting to try this out as well. Just wanted to point out for people that do watch some of my videos. This may seem slightly different or something, or that I might have slightly more difficulty filming. It's because I can't use my front camera on my phone, which I usually film with, due to it being broken. Uh, or broken and broken. I cracked my screen and then it kind of hit it. Either way, I'm just like, I'm trying to look at the mirror on the other side of the room to make sure that I film correctly without, like, being any problems. So, um, let's get on with what this challenge is all about. So what do you have to do in this challenge? Well, the first one is that I need to cut the shower time in half. Now, I usually spend time like 15, 20 minutes, sometimes even 30 minutes in the shower. So the goal for me is to keep it under 10 and try to get it under five minutes. Number two is to cut all disposable plastic use. And just to make it clear, Recycling is nor in Norway is usually no problem, so however, when doing this challenge, I try to be better at bringing my own lunch to school instead of buying food there, because if you bring, if you buy food at the school, you usually need like plastic forks, for instance, and uh, therefore I'm going to try not to do that. Number three is to recycle or recyclable waste, which is something I do anyways, so that will be no problem. Number four is probably the hardest in my opinion will probably be the hardest and that is going meatless because like st like steak and such like I don't mind not eating much of like uh, a lot of like beef I am not that much I don't I, I don't eat that much of beef and uh, stuff like that and steak I prefer to eat other types of uh, of meat so that's not a problem however chicken and for instance, me to taco. Yeah, that will be the hardest part of the challenge, but I will try. So I'm gonna try to go meatless throughout all next week. Number five is to reduce overall water consumption. I've tried to be more conscious of this recently, but it can be easy to forget. So I gotta work hard to remember everything, but you know, I got goals to follow, so I gotta remember this. So that is the Go Green challenge. I will leave links down below for if you want to do it. And I will basically vlog every day and um, we'll see by the end of the week how well I will do. I am uh, nervous, but I think this will be a fun little challenge. It's all about going green, you know? So yeah. Hope you guys are all for this. Hope you guys will support me through it. And uh, yeah. <sighs> Let's get going. Okay, so we're back. <clears throat> um, we're officially starting off the challenge. You guys already know what it's about as I showed you last time. Uh, just seconds ago, I guess. Anyways. Uh, the meatless part, um, not going well because I literally had pizza for breakfast and for lunch now. So that's not going well. Um, yesterday I planned out, like, or like I took a shower to see how long I have taken this week, or last week with the showering. And I took right over 5 minutes, which is my goal, is to be on 5 minutes. That's my goal, is to manage to have my shower time at 5 minutes or less over the week and I will shower at least three times this week due to uh, PE or due to dance <clears throat> so I think that's it for now and I will see you guys when I get home I'm gonna have tomato soup when I get home and so I mean I am following it there now I just have to see it throughout the rest of the week Star Wars. 
<laughs> hey guys, so you're not gonna see my face a lot due to my camera being broken and everything. So I had to buy myself food because I tried what I actually got with me and the issue is it was one of the worst things I've ever eaten. So mom has to the rest of the have like, the possibility for me to throw this away and everything so it's gonna be good. Like, the plastic and such. And besides I'm keeping the meatless part because it's an omelette with the cheese and such. See, I am smart. I am genius. This is perfect for when I'm supposed to go kind of vegan for a week. Hey everyone! So, news. Uh, I decided to just drop the whole go meatless thing. And um, I can explain, okay? The reason is because my parents are gonna have chicken apparently today and would find another solution for me. But it was my dad who tried to convince me to go meatless. I personally want to just skip that part. It's not my fault. I like meat and I like chicken. I very highly love my chicken. Did people know that? No, probably not. But I love chicken and that was just... That was unfair. That was rude. <laughs> okay, I'm done now. Um, it's the second day and I was like, fuck the go meatless thing, okay? I just came out of the shower and I managed to spend under five minutes in the shower. So... I already technically kind of completed the <laughs> cutting my shower time in half, like technically I cut it by like one third because I originally spent like 15 to 20 minutes ish, now I spent five, <laughs> less than five actually, I'm really proud of myself. So um, um I don't know, I'm working myself there and I am very proud of myself so... Wednesday, my dudes. Okay, so today, um, obviously I showered yesterday, so you guys already see that. I'm not gonna shower today. I am today spending my time practicing for my mock exam in math, which is tomorrow. Uh, which, yes, we are allowed to do so. We're allowed to stay at home to practice. Well, no, I'm just gonna sit and watch Japanese videos, okay? Don't, don't touch me. Um, I ate macaroni and sausage <laughs> for breakfast slash lunch. And um, that was leftovers. So, I mean, that's positive. That's positive. Yeah? So, we just gotta see about how this challenge is gonna continue from there. I'm excited. I, I, I have to finish up the, uh, the challenge. It's like I am thinking more eco friendly. I am. Ugh. But I gotta admit that when it comes to trash and such, it's not really that difficult when you are in Norway because you can pretty much recycle anything here. We have like four trash like things. I don't know anymore. Trash cans, yeah. Yeah, we have like four different ones. One for like glass and metal. One for plastic. One for uh, for like paper and stuff like that. And one for food. We have where's the plastic? I don't know. It's we have we have a lot of different ones at least, and uh, it's something that the country is very much like highly prioritizing. So being eco-friendly living in Norway is not the hardest. Which, oh my god, my hair is looking ugly. I knew that, but like, yeah. But yeah. So when doing this, I don't really have a problem. Like, the meatless thing was literally my biggest challenge, and I just went floof it, because... <clears throat> I love me some chicken. Remember? That was literally yesterday. That was what, like, caught me down. We had tomato soup on Monday, and that went well. And then, then, then... Then the Tuesday came, and I was like, fuck it, I'm, I'm stopping this, I can't do this. So, in conclusion... I'm gonna continue the challenge, but I'm not doing the meatless thing anymore. I stopped that yesterday, so. And also I dance, and it's kind of hard not to, to like not have any like protein from meat in your body when you dance, unless you have a under possibilities, which I don't currently, so. Good morning, guys. Oh god. Uh, so today I have my math mock exams, so I won't be filming so much today. I'm just doing it today in the morning. I mean, what? I am so tired. 
I literally was up until like 2.30 a.m. And instead of sleeping before my math mock exam, what did I do? Watch a freaking Comes Against Humanity stream. It was so worth it. So worth it. I mean, come on. First of all, was Tori won. Second of all, Maddie did a flip. I mean, come on. Seriously, I'm sorry. I'm done. I'm done talking about FB for this video. Am I though? Probably not. I mean, if you, if you know me. I mean, come on. Either way. So, I'm gonna make myself uh, some food. Where right now, I'm currently like, I'm just going to cut some bread and put some chocolate, like, type of... <laughs> Um, what's it even called in English? I don't even know anymore. But it basically just going to be putting, to be using, the, yeah, no, I'm tired. Whoop. I'm, ju I'm just gonna have a slice of bread, you know, some slices of bread with that to um, have for lunch and possibly for breakfast. I'm trying to figure out if I'm gonna have chocolate pudding as well because I hate chocolate pudding which is as for people that you know I have problems with milk so I have soy milk chocolate pudding which is hella good and for people that haven't tried it you haven't lived <laughs> you gotta try things before you judge it I'm just saying that my dad he doesn't like soy milk at all he doesn't like well oh soy milk at all soy milk and I was like try the chocolate soy milk and soy pudding and he did and he was like okay this is not that bad and i was like exactly what did you say earlier so yeah so i'm gonna go make myself some food and i'll get back to you guys okay sup guys okay so currently the sun is kind of bothering anyways um my mom won't be home until like an hour or so as i am filming this part and i made myself some food and, you know, I said I wasn't going to do the go vegetarian thing, but I kind of did today with that I didn't eat meat. I ate macaroni for my, for dinner, and I had, uh, and I had my math mock exam, like I mentioned earlier, which I had, I, I had slices of bread with me, I mean, come on. Uh, so I've been doing good, I'd say. Um, today's dance, meaning a uh, shower. And I've been focusing really well on trying to be more eco-friendly. So I am working myself there. And I have people who people are glad. Like I am trying. But as you might have noticed, I really don't really pay attention to a lot of things. Because it kind of comes natural when you live in Norway to do recy to recycle and to not waste as much. You spend more time actually using like things that are actually possible to use multiple times. It's kind of a thing. But yeah, so I will see you after dance. Yes. So, um, change of plans, I just took back, like, I just switched off, here, the switch off. I just changed it to back into my classes. Um, quick update, I didn't go to dance, so I am not going to go shopping yet. I'm shopping tomorrow after pee. Um, there's some stuff happened on the road, so, uh, so that led me to not get into Dance. Um, I will tell you guys a later vlog about that because this is a very serious thing that I think something we should save for its own video. Anyways, so I did keep up with whole no meat thing all day up until after this event where I ended up like I want to I want like a couple of things with in in English goes for that I don't know. Yeah, like a bacon and pizza kind of thing, yeah. So I have that. And needed that a lot. I needed energy to have it. I am so tired, and luckily enough, I only have to meet tomorrow. I don't have anything else I do to uh, rehearsal for, for the oral exams in psychology. So, yeah, I might want to do the so that's it for this part of the vlog. I will not see you guys in the next part of this. In a few seconds for you guys, but it will be next day for me. Hey! 
Okay. So, back at it again. Okay. Uh, today, I kind of forgot to film. I basically ate macaroni when I can't, when I, for breakfast sort of thing. Yep, because it was kind of brunch breakfast. And I was like, I want macaroni. <laughs> Um, and then I had type of cereal when I came home. So really, eating wise, for some reason, I'm just like, when I'm alone, I obviously can't go meatless for some time, for some reason, I don't know. Anyways, um, uh, when it comes to other things, I'm gonna take a shower really, really soon. And first I gotta clean my room. So I'm gonna do that first, and then, oh my god, I got this. Um, then I'm gonna take a shower, just gonna see if I manage to keep up with the whole staying under five minutes type of thing. And yeah, I'm just trying to fix my lens first. My mom will be home soon. So yeah. So my goal is basically to just... Uh, sorry. Uh, so my goal is today is to just... When I'm gonna take a shower, be careful with that. When it comes to the other parts of the Go Green Challenge, things have been going well. I am not the type of person to just let things be as it is, as you know. I'm more of the old, you gotta recycle type of person, which I do. I do quite commonly. My eyes are burning, I'm sorry. So yeah, um, nothing to worry about there, so yeah. Hey, hey. Quick vlog before I got a run. Um, did was right over five minutes today, uh, but you know I'm gonna probably shower one more time before I'm done with the week. So the shower thing is really the one that I vlog about the most. That's in food. Yeah, I already dropped the meatless thing, but yeah, I just like to talk about food. <laughs> Either way, so there's like this. I will try to go less with meat due to the whole wanting to try at least to do some work on meatless kind of thing um so yeah um today we're going out to eat so but we're going to like you know, i think we're like we're gonna eat where we're going because we're going to theater so my parents i mean like it's like, really like oh, oh, oh. so yeah um i'll get back to you guys because i'm like really exhausted today so just gonna don't question that I draw on my hands, by the way, or my arms. So I'm just gonna get ready. Hey, I'm back. Oh, there we go. There's a good angle. Yeah, um, so I basically I'm just gonna make sure I have all my makeup up. Um, I wear very little makeup, my dad. Anyways, um, my eyes. Um, so first of all, the plate was awesome. I'm gonna talk about that later, actually, because this is a, that was a good plate that's important. Either way. So, um, I'm going to work tomorrow, which is also where we work today, because I work at the place where it's a, like, theater. it's a theater, but it's also partly like, it's a theater and concert house, you could say, it is a theater and concert, it's all that, and it has a restaurant, and I work as, in the, as a dishwasher there. So, uh, what's going to happen is basically that, so basically, uh, bleh, I'm quite, I'm tired, I'm sorry. Um, obviously we all know I'm failing on the meatless thing. I had a hamburger today, I'm so cold. But yeah, um, but, there is, but I know for a fact that when it comes to the work, because I do work there myself, I do work and see them do re recycle and everything like that. So I can assure you they recycle, so everything is fine. I know that place pretty well. In the food cart so I think this is gonna be fine I I think also tomorrow is gonna be fine so yeah and therefore I think that like for me this is feel like an era really weird week that has the, the gold green challenge has been like an average day for me except I tried to eat less meat but then I just failed hard but other than that it's been a pretty good average week so yeah Hey friends, I have work today, so um, how is today gonna work? Oh, wow, camera okay, moves a little bit. I'm sorry. I was just looking at my computer. Anyways, uh, so not much to do today, really. I just gotta switch hands. So 
I don't really have much to say. I probably already mentioned something yesterday. I don't remember. I'm tired. Either way, I've been cleaning today, meaning I've been recycling because I've been cleaning. Yay! I am totally working out this Go Green Challenge by actually doing the things I'm supposed to. See, I can. Except for the Go Meatless part because that's just a fail. No, we're going to have pizza today. Delivery pizza. I'm not sorry. We can literally recycle pretty much anything in Norway. So, yeah. <laughs>